center down the middle with the driver. Good going with that driver because he knows Spieth is right down the middle and he takes it just over. So the Americans off to a great start here. One. Knocked down. Pretty shot. Pretty shot. Nice tempo there, Roger. Yeah, this one's a little left of the hole. Not his best. Oh, that's a good try. It was always right. Always pushed it. Old location back left. So middle of the green is. A smart play, ooh, just barely carries the hazard. Gets it on the front part of the green. Need to win the hole and square the match. And it does. For Reed, 181. Their partners are both up in proximity of the green, so much closer. And that comes up short in the bunk. Should be able to do well from here. I would say so. Did he get all of it? Yes, he did. Oh, a little oh. action there. That is a nice shot. From 105. Seems to like it. That was perfect. Just not quite long enough. Do the, his normal Drano stroke. There you go. Perfect. Picks the tee up quickly. John, you were talking about this being one of the strongest U.S. teams ever. I think I agree with you. I think it's probably the most family-like U.S. teams we've ever seen. That's a cool little draw. Great swing. Well, Johnny and Jake, we also talked off the top about your 81 U.S. Ryder Cup team, Johnny, when you said that this could be the greatest uh, cup team ever. That Shape something up against the wind to hold it. it starts right of the hole and hanging over there. Uh, Mike collect. Yeah, it's fine. And this is moving to the right of the hole a little bit. And he and Reed are going to be right next to each other down in that collection area. And hold steady. Right to left. This is virtually the same putt Jordan faced. Well, that's left of it right away. He knew that. Tiger! This pulled left. It's headed at the bunker. That's it. This is a good looking shot here. Looks like the other team is going to make birdie, and if you can hold your team in there, that's a big thing. Right that. there. Send it, Jordan. I think he's looking left. It's going right at the bunkers in the middle, but being held up by the wind and come up well short of them. Oh yeah! Wow. This going at the left fairway, left side of the fairway. Getting up against that wind. He likes it. He wouldn't be running otherwise. Oh, just right into the wind, and what a beauty that is. This is a heck, heck of a bird. Right if he makes it. Yeah. Into the wind at the eighth. Oh, three metal. You just don't want to go in that right bunker. And that's where he is. Yeah, this is a hard looking shot here. This is a little left of the hole. Wants the wind to move it some to the right. Ah, takes a little kid. A brilliant play from there. Yep. 
Well, Reed is already laid up. Blue Station is already laid up. I'm trying to be really explicit. Speaking of Reed, <laughs> there he is. Thrown up in the air, a little bit right of the hole. Okay. That's well, going to work away, though. Just on the front left. Well, that actually sailed it up into the wind, and it's getting killed by the wind. This is nowhere near there. Wow. It's just got to get it there. I mean. Another eight iron. This one kept on a lower trajectory. It's got to get up, too. Man, this wind is like hitting into a mat. The ball way below his feet. Uh, what an excellent shot. It's so hard to get down to that ball. He's also been in his pocket a few times. Planning for his draw. Down the right side, is that going to come back? Yeah, I think so. I think enough. Yep. Yeah, that's fine. Reed with a one up lead on Day and Ustazen, who just cut into it at the 10th. And Speed looking for a roll off the edge and coming back. Speed for Birdie at 11. Pretty good hook, but not that much, so Ooh, that was not pretty. And Patrick Reed looks to be turning that one a little too much. Oh. Come on. That lands on the down slope. He's the center. That's oh, the saddle. Downhill all the way to the edge of the green. Hold the door! Oh, and that checked up right away. That's why I wanted to hit one more club. To keep from losing three holes in a row and losing and going one down. Jordan Spieth on the tee at this par 4 13th as Russell. you've been watching the tee shots in this match at this par 4. Again just coming off of a spirited discussion at the previous hold at the 12th which the internationals ended up winning. Kind of wrap that whole discussion up. Four good tee shots. There's now Reed. This putt should move a little left to win the hole. No. Yes, not much green to work with. You tried to play the big spinner and got too little sand. So free drop, second shot for Spieth, landed outside the hazard. And so Spieth's trying to take advantage of the good fortune, and he does. Let's go to 15. And Spieth for birdie to win the hole. Starts left of the hole, cutting back. Just a little left of the hole. How much will it go? Clear to the back edge of the green. All right, Patrick Reed in with a two. Going 
going down that hill. It's just been that kind of week for the internationals. Reed squinting in the sun at 17, and that is stiff. What a shot. Cut right in the very front of the green. That's coming in much higher and right of the hole. Good chance he's going to make this. Point for the United States. Two and one victory for Spieth and Reed who keep on rolling at Liberty National.